Hello everyone, welcome to another Diablo 4 tutorial video. Today in this video I will show you how to fix error code 34202 in Diablo 4. Now this error code is connected with connectivity issues, so usually it's connected to server issues as well. And uh, you know, while most of the times you cannot solve these problems, I will present you a couple of solutions that you can resort to when solving this particular problem. So uh, obviously, as you can see, error code uh, 34202 is an annoying Diablo 4 error message that essentially means there was an issue with connecting. Uh, as usual, that's what uh, the issues are with Diablo 4. To make things worse, the error can also kick out of your queue and even out of your game. It's typically follow up with message server not available. So unfortunately, usually this error is just due to server congestion as a lot of players are trying to join Diablo 4 at once. Uh, however, you can in some cases uh, fix this by again checking the official Blizzard CS Twitter. Now this is actually a um, this this person is actually a Blizzard Entertainment developer, so they will actually post here on here as well when there is issues. Also, you can double check that you're on the latest version. So if you have got a new update, uh, you know for a new patch make sure you're on the latest version. Not only that, but make sure your internet connection is stable. All of these are basically uh, things that you need to take in into consideration when uh, you know going uh, um, out in, uh, in the game, in the Diablo 4. And once you join Diablo 4, if you checked all of these, but if the connection is still not working, then what I would do is I would definitely go to blizzard.com support here on the Blizzard CS Twitter and I would log in into my uh, account here and then I would basically go and try to contact support or go and open the ticket because that will be pretty much the only way how you'll be able to fix this issue other than you know actually fixing it with your internet or you know uh, other things as well because it's usually a server issue. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, hopefully you still find it useful and we'll see you in the next video.